We bought the hotel in uh, March of 2013. Jim is a preservationist and an antique restorer, and I'm a historian and a retired museum curator, and I've written uh, three books. And uh, so yeah, it was. Uh, we knew that was something that would be perfect for us to do for our retirement. Was to kind of you know restore an old building. This is a you know 170 year old building, so it's mm. it's got tremendous history. This was a, a stagecoach frontier hotel, and there's not many of those around before the railroad, before the Civil War. Mm. So it's it's just got amazing history. On the day that we signed the papers to the title of the the building. Uh, we came back here and we were all excited and ready to celebrate with some champagne and, and uh, when we did open it, uh, we had a, our first experience and uh, she came forward in a very big way and uh, so that's uh, how we discovered it was haunted and they just keep coming things, forward. <laughs> things just keep happening, you know, it's, yeah. it's just unusual things happen here. It's actually all day, all night, it's whenever they feel like coming forward. And uh, we have some that are mostly our, our uh, shadow figures. They enjoy it mostly in the day. Uh, I know that they like to pick on Jim a lot, and so he sees them quite often. I would call it the most haunted building in Texas. Keep an open mind, and uh, they're ready to introduce themselves to you, so we hope that uh, they give you some evidence while you're here.